Hello Internet, I'm your only May, and it's time for another episode of Red vs Blue. This is Season 15, Episode 2. Now as I should say with all my reaction videos, please click the link in the description below to go watch the actual episode yourself. Like, subscribe, all of that stuff, then come back to watch this video. Okay. Good. Support the official release. Okay, so in the last episode, we saw some people who are not the reds and blues. I still stand by that. There are so many giveaways, it's just... It's just too obvious. A reporter who's trying to uncover the story as to why these imposters are doing this. And also found out that Chorus decided not to be in the UNSC. So... Here's how that's gonna go. And from what I can tell of just from like the thumbnail and the bit of the video that showed like when I just got the episode ready, it looks like we're going back to Blood Gulch. So that means sister! Yay! And funny enough, I actually knew that sister was gonna be alive for all those years when they said she was dead. I was like, nope. Nope, she's alive. Nope, there's no way. And what happened at the end of season 13? She was alive. So, it'll be interesting to see her again. Uh, curious as to how she coped like, all those years in a box canyon by herself. So... Yeah, I'm just gonna show up and hit play now. Doom, ja, da, doom, ja. He's doing the music. Dun, 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 dun. That'll help sync up, actually. Cheers. I am brainstorming a sweet soundtrack for this location. Quick goofing off. <laughs> I'm ready to start. The Reds and Blues were mostly strangers when they were first assigned here. A box canyon that may as well be in the middle of nowhere. From these hmm. humble beginnings, they've gone on to influence the galaxy as we know it. Are you talking to me or the camera? <laughs> what? The camera's on your helmet, dude. Did you get that or not? Yeah, I got it. I wasn't rolling, though. Is that what you mean? <laughs> I'm not Frank. Frank quit. What? He quit. He said he was sick of getting arrested and shot at. Some people just can't take the heat. Fair enough. What about you, new Frank? You got new Frank. Yeah. So you have some experience in combat journalism? Yeah. Well, weddings. This is your first job. No, 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 no. It's my first internship. Do you have a degree at the very least? Well, yeah. I mean, I will soon. Just like 47 more credits, and then I graduate. Oh. And then oh, I'm not sure what nice. I'm going to do. You know, I think I'll probably move to L.A., but that's like what everyone does. I mean, what do you hmm. think? Do I really have to live there to make movies? What I really want I to do I don't have to. Direct, blockbuster. Carlos, you penny-pinching cheapskate bastard. I'm going to skin your cat for this. All right, you. Jesus. What's your name? I'm actually thinking of adopting a stage name. Tell me, what Just do you think keep of calling him New Frank. With an X and a Z? I am not calling you that. How about Mick J or M Night Axeltron? Just stop. Your job is to follow my lead until you get the hang of things, or until I find my tripod. Got it? Got it. One question though: Are you married to this story? Because I got my own ideas for stories that would make really awesome movies. Like, what if we did one about a comet that hits the moon and sends it crashing in Earth? That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. We could mm. call it Moon Doom. Enough. And shoot no. it all in one long, uninterrupted day. Enough. Shut up. I'm only going to tell you this once, so listen closely. We find the facts. We tell the story. We do not make things up. We're journalists, and truth is our currency. Got it. Truth. Awesome. But what if we told the truth with, like, wicked cinematography? Like, oh, uh, we could start with a slow pan of one of these base walls, and there you are on top, <laughs> and then boom, snap zoom to a whip pan. You're over there now. No, smash cut, Dutch angle, reverse zoom. I'm going to smash cut your empty skull against that rock if you don't shut the fuck up and roll camera. Got it? I, okay. I'm sorry. Jax. Yeah, that was a Jax. bit far. Jax. I lost my temper. I still prefer New Frank. Me. I'd like to start over. I'll try not to yell. Do you want to try one of my shots? We'll do it both ways. Sweet, because I'm pretty sure we can use that tank as a dolly. That's actually how they did it in the actual episode. The Reds and Blues started as simulation troopers, 
used to train the super soldiers a project freelancer. The details of their time here are sketchy, or classified, or both. So we just don't know how formative these early years were for them. If these walls could talk, perhaps we'd know why they turned into Chorus's bloody Q sister, stuff, please. For money, fame, or simply for fun. Hey! Yay, sister! Maybe it's dead down here! Oh, hi there. We thought this place was deserted. Whoa! What's with the camera? What are you two doing? Is it kinky? We're <laughs> conducting an investigation. Fire marshal? Shit! We're up to code, I swear! We're not firemen. We're journalists. We're doing an in-depth investigation about the Reds and Blues. Why are you doing a story about my brother? Brother? You're Kakina Griff? Hey, you know my name! Big fucking deal! Get off my face! Please, can you spare a few minutes for an interview? It's important. We're trying to figure out what happened that made the Reds and Blues go from heroes to criminals. God, fine. Someone has to start setting this dumb story straight. What you need, lady? Just information. I know there's a story here. This sort of be good. I don't know how that's gonna help you. Not against Reds and Blues always is. Five phase coming on, and the camera guy's already here, so let's do this thing. Great. Wait, what? <laughs> and then the ship took off and like either exploded or warped to hyperspace. I was never really sure. Uh, that was right over there. And that was the last I saw of Tex. Everyone else got reassigned and left right after that. I'm surprised to find you still here. What have you been up to in the meantime? Well, Just first, posse throwing raves in the caves to meet cute boys. Totally worked. My number skyrocketed. Then I got bored and went through another by phase. Then all of a sudden the shows were selling out, so I was like, fuck it. I'm gonna sell this bitch out and make a whole week long festival. Then that sold out. Slow down. You run a music festival out of Blood Gulch? I wish. We added a film fest after the first year. Then a Comic Con for the nerds, and a Gaming Con for the geeks, and Eco Con for the hippies. Now we're about to take over some ancient alien temples for a desert arts fest. Burning Gulch. I wanted to call it Desert Titties, but that shit was taken. <laughs> that sounds like quite an operation. Damn, lady, you ain't kidding. You got any idea how much time I spend talking about fucking merch? Sometimes I miss Jesus. being a simple hussy. But lady time fucks no man. So, backtracking huh. just a bit to the Reds and Blues. Oh, there goes the Bechdel test. The Reds and Blues you described sound mostly harmless. How do you reconcile that with what they're doing now? I know it's my not brother, them. Lady. He hates showing it, but he's a total softy inside. The evidence does suggest otherwise. The helmet recovered from the last attack was traced to Project Freelancer. Occam's razor. Occam can suck himself. This is some conspiracy shit. Like, what if it's a government thing? Jet fuel can't JFK the moon landing. That's an interesting angle. <gasps> you should interview the Illuminati. Thank you, Kaikaina. <laughs> I think I have what I need. You still think Griff is guilty. I'm not sitting in judgment. I'm just gathering information. Well, if it's info you want, talk to Vic. Who's Vic? Not who. What? Oh yeah, Vic. Ba ba ba, yes it can. How exactly can a computer be a weirdo? Oh, you'd be surprised. Welcome to Vic's party cavern. Oh, I love how they answered this. You are really an AI? They actually put Halo 5 spawns in a Halo 2 map. So you have records of the Reds and Blues? Of all their time here? Oh, yeah. I got those records for you right here, Chica Mosfina. I have had some time on my hands, so to speak. Hmm. So I have been cutting them up into nice little shorty shorts. Five minutes each. Perfecto. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to copy the record. Set. Oh, I love that. that happen. On it, Blue Bonnet. Tell you what, though, dude. Real talk here. I'll be your genie in a bottle. I will do whatever you want, but after I grant you your three wishes, you gotta do something for me. What do you say? You want out of the computer? No way, dude. I just need you to reach back behind me here and go ahead and pull that plug. I'd do it myself, but I ain't got no hands. No hands. No hands. Won't that kill you? Oh, yeah. Can't wait. I'm oh. Out, 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 out. This charade has gone on long enough, dude. My ceaseless existence is an eternal torment. I need you to kill me, dude. Do that. Hey, I. This took a weird turn. Wait, wait. My God. Are you serious? No way, I was just joking, dude. How, how, how? Yeah, got you good, didn't I? Good one, Vic. It's a, it's a messed up joke, Vic. It's an ethical nightmare. <laughs> yeah, for real, would you do it, though? Would you pull the plug? If I begged you, please, please, please. 
get in this nightmare. Shuffle me off this mortal coil, dude. I'm ready to embrace the void. Pull the plug. Do it. Uh. I'm getting depressed. What? Hey, just kidding, dude. Got you again. Wink, wink. Oh, pull the plug. <laughs> just joking. Not joking. Kill me, please. I want the to die. Not. It's opposite day. I don't not want to die, but I really do. What do you say? This, this is just getting weird. Oh, hey. What would you end up doing? Secure the record. Oh, Jesus. Y you didn't. It's better if you don't know. We have the files now. That's all that matters. Yeah, I don't think I want to know what well you did. Back to the Capitol? Are you kidding? We just got our first lead. I've got 105 minute long security logs to get through. We'll see where the story takes us from there, but one way or another. I You're in for one hell of a story. Just getting started. And a whole lot of laughs. Oh god. The music. It's so ominous. Alright, who's gonna show up here? The fuck are you? I thought that was Locus for a minute. I I honestly was starting to think I was Locus gonna turn up. But that guy did give me a bit of a Locus vibe. I was somewhat curious what was him, but no way, isn't the Locus helmet in Halo 5? So we would Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is, but oh well. Uh... Anyway. Oh boy, it was good seeing Sister again. And hearing all the stuff she's been up to. Wow, she's been busy. Doing a whole lot of stuff with that canyon. Take from that what that will. So, anyway. Uh, Jesus, Vic! Oh, God. That's something I never expected. From this series, although what should I have expected? <laughs> Aside from Halo Spawn standing around talking. <laughs> but, uh... Hmm. That, that, got, that got dark. And I do love the callback to the whole like a uh, hundred like five minute long little videos <laughs> just because that's what red versus blue is well mostly but, but there, are, there are like a few one off ten, 10 minutes there so and i love the fact that they like well they, they obviously use the green screen in halo 5 just got the spartans and then just edited them into that scene in halo 2 like i, I know how it works but I, I, I always like it when they do stuff like that. It's like, including all the halos. I like it. Okay, so they've got the Blood Gulch side of the story covered at this point. So does that mean they're going to find someone to fill them in on what happened via seasons 6 through 10, maybe? Or actually, no, seasons... 6 through 8 would make more sense, and then 9 and 10. Although, well, then again. Actually, that might be a decent way of finding out what actually went down. Like, when Church was inside the memory unit. Like, what did everyone else do? Like, how did they find Carolina? That That's the sort of stuff I want to know. Could be brought up in this. I hope so. Anyway, I am just going to end the video here, so thanks for watching, all of that stuff. Here's my Tracer outro. Bye. Hello loves, Tracer here. You've just watched a video by your only mate. Subscribe, like, comment, and check out his other stuff. Cheers loves!